in the nighttime. Watch what she doing, it like shine. Drunk niggas try. Hey y'all, so as y'all can see, I have my winter coat on. But wait, first things first, let me turn off this real quick. Okay, so hey y'all. So as you can see from the title, I will be giving y'all a room tour. Um, I'm glad that my room is clean right now. My hair is not done, I look so crazy. But I just wanted to give y'all a tour of my room. I will be doing it, I don't have no one to hold the camera for me, so I will just show y'all like everything that's going on in my room. This is an overview of my room. And you're probably like, okay, that's it. Like, this is the end of the video. But no. I'm going to break down everything in my room. Show y'all what's going on in my closet. Y'all are going to be in my business today. So, the first thing I'm going to start out with is my sink. So, on my campus, everyone always has um, a sink in their room. It doesn't matter if you live with someone, if you're by yourself. In my case, I live by myself. Um, you just always have, like, a sink in your room. So I always appreciated that and I personally just like to utilize this light compared to um, the big light like this. This is usually how my room would look. I just like, I feel like it feels more cozy to me. Um, the first thing we have like this that has a cabinet in there which is really nice and I just keep like my soap for like dishwashing soap. If I'm feeling lazy which is very often. I will just wash my plates in my own sink instead of going to the kitchen and then I also just have like any cough medicine that I may need um, whenever I am in the area of my school I get really like it triggers my allergies and I think it's because this is more like an outdoorsy area there's lots of bluffs like it's just very outdoorsy and that's not what I'm used to being from the city so it does make me feel like it triggers my allergies basically so yeah this is the drawer we have the mirror here and under the drawer we have this under the sink I mean we have the false drawer right here so there's nothing going on right there and then under here is my let me turn on the light for y'all under the sink I have a, a whole bunch of things I would use so this is what I take with me to the shower it's just like my caddy um, some bleach to clean out my sink um, vacuum cleaner I mean um, some shampoo some gel stuff face cleanser as well as extra hand soaps because as y'all can see I'm running low on hand soap right there there's a whole bunch of hair products toothpaste extra toothbrushes are also down here and then my Clorox stuff is down here too it looks really cluttered and messy but I know where everything is. <laughs> this will probably be the only messy thing that y'all will see. Alright, on to the next thing. And then also right here, I just have my towel my um, for my showers and stuff. And my recycling bin is right there. My sink is my fridge. So, in my fridge, it's just like a basic mini fridge that I have here. Um... Yeah, it's just a basic mini fridge that I have. And then on the side, which is my favorite part of my fridge, is my little caddy for my fridge. This is where I'll put like my um, plates and pots and stuff after I'm done drying them. And it's just very convenient to keep all that stuff on the side right here. And then under my fridge, I just have a crate that has really nothing in it right now. It just has like a duffel bag, empty duffel bag in there but I usually store stuff. The paper bag that y'all are seeing over there, both of them, they are for a party that I hosted for a campus club that I am part of. And then right here I have my ear diffuser. Everybody has one on campus. It, or ear purifier, I mean. Everyone has one on campus. So it's just always on. I personally just like to keep it on high. Some people like to keep it on low just because it's very loud for them. And then I just have my mirror right here and an outlet plug to plug in my fridge and the um, air purifier. So under, beside my um, fridge I have under my bed, 
rest stop there before we start with my bed itself which is nothing really to say about my bed but I have my laundry basket under there as well as some suitcases that I use to bring my shoes and clothes to campus and then I also have risers and the cool thing about my risers it actually has like outlets on my risers and I got these from Target um, I don't really remember how much they are I've had them since freshman year but yeah I have some risers right here and I really like it because it has like the USB plugs and then also the plugs itself so that's always convenient for me um, and then my shelves I have two shelves as you can see I really did not know how to utilize the space of the shelves the way that I did it I have like a lot of empty space right there but I just recently organized it like this the paintings up there they were originally over there but they kept falling down and I sleep <laughs> like my head goes over there so I didn't want anything to just drop on my head but um, yeah these are just all paintings that I've done over the time at different events and stuff um, on my shelf as well it just has like my hand sanitizer just miscellaneous things a uh, book that I'm using for class as well as um, some Polaroid film camera uno uh, lotion I always like to keep lotion and Vaseline close to my bedside just because they I like to put it on at night and then also put Vaseline when I wake up fresh in the morning um, and then I have my Polaroid camera my mask on my cloth masker on top of the bear and it actually sings like baby by um, Justin Bieber it's so cute my friend got it for me and um, then I also have the Bible right there and my extra pair well those are my main glasses the glasses I'm wearing right now I just wear it whenever I'm in my room and I've been in my room so often I just wear those so um, yeah so right here I have some more storage space I have a little mini ottoman right here um, that I just keep some stuff in there it usually just has like my first aid kit batteries those kind of things um, and then right here I just have also storage straight storage space in that part too then I have my shower shoes and another trash that I just keep um, my trash in then we will move over to my desk so with my desk area, I this is actually the first time in four years I've used the desk area as much as I have. Usually I do not sit here, I go to the library to do work, but for some reason I find this to be actually um, convenient for me to use. Um, so right here on my desk, I have my, um, this is actually a gift that I got, and if I just put my phone on this, I can charge it. Let me see where my phone my phone even over here okay sometimes it's very touchy like sometimes it will not do it so I promise like it is a charger it's a holder slash phone charger um, then also my ear diffuser and my phone is also something I can charge right here too then I have a mirror that I like to use whenever I'm doing like videos and I just want to quickly do my makeup for the video this is the mirror that I'll use and then I have some books under here that I'm using for classes and some tissue hand sanitizer and any um, office supplies are at the top area right here. So yeah, let me just think. turn on this little area right there. All right, so now on to my closet space. So. Let me try to give y'all a full overview of my closet and we'll just start with this one. So it has my clothes in here as well as my shoes and my textbook boxes that I um, would use to return my um, books. Then we're not going to go directly to these middle areas yet but we'll go right into the other closet and this one also just has my clothes and also my laundry baskets in here and um, my stool that I use because I can't reach stuff that's up here so I have a stool to get up there um, then we'll do a drawer so in this drawer it has like my in this drawer it has like my night clothes 
um, bed sheets are in here and then a little bit of some winter stuff so like hats gloves those kind of things then in this drawer it just has like my undergarments in here I'm not gonna fully open it y'all can see some socks that are in there as well and then in this drawer this is my makeup drawer it has like my makeup palettes in here that's so in the back area um, then my also my hair straighteners and all that stuff so just hair and makeup stuff is over here and then the bottom one there's really nothing in there besides like sprays so you know. now my favorite part of my room would have to be this one and this is where I keep all my food in here it's like my food cupboard um, I have like my cereal over here this is where I have like Tupperware in there um, and this is also like my grocery bag or I'll just put like my Tupperware back in that bag and then it just has like all the groceries that I would use um, and yeah so I originally was going to put all this stuff on my shelves over here but um, my mom had like a I was originally going to put all this stuff over here on my shelf but my mom had like the concern about um, dust getting on my food and stuff so that's why I just kept it in the cupboard so now the last piece of my room would be the cupboards up there so I have to get my stool So this cupboard just has like my forks in here, this bag just has like extra mask, hand sanitizer, gloves, all that stuff is in this cupboard. Now to the next one. This cupboard has like all of my detergent and laundry stuff that I may need over here and, and then this cupboard it just has a box of tissue up there um just because i didn't know where to like really put the tissue box i just kept it up there so we're back thank you so much for watching i gave y'all like a quick little room tour of my room um be sure to like and subscribe and comment and do all of that watch some other videos and happy holidays bye